Hi, this is Dave Matthew with an Audio Precision Quick Tip. A quick tip provides a brief overview of an APX feature or function. In this quick tip, we're going to look at the Audible Monitor, which provides an easy way for you to listen to the audio present at the analyzer inputs. The Audible Monitor uses the sound features built into the Windows operating system and requires a sound card or other compatible PC sound capability. The controls for the Audible Monitor are available in the toolbar in both sequence mode and bench mode. There's an on-off button right there in the toolbar and a button to open the Audible Monitor dialog. Configuring the Audible Monitor is pretty straightforward. You can select which input channels you'd like to listen to, assigning each channel to the right or left sound output, or both. Since the signal levels at the APX input can vary across a wide range, you can set either a fixed amount of gain for the audible monitor or set the gain to automatic and let the software ride the levels for you. By default, you'll be monitoring the full input signal and any signal path input filters applied will affect the audible monitor signal. You can optionally listen to the THD plus N residual, the portion of the signal that remains after the fundamental is removed by a tuned notch filter. This can sometimes be helpful in diagnosing the source of the distortion by listening to the character of the residual signal. That's all for now. You'll find more information in the documentation provided with APX500. Look for additional quick tips at AP.com.